Dave. Mark, benvenuto. Welcome to Italy. Thank you, thank you. What a beautiful setting for us to talk about Europe's latest activities in sustainability, right? Yeah, because that's where the world is headed fast. That's right. Let's go. All right. You know, I think it's very fitting that we are in a place where innovation has been happening for so long. I mean, from the Romans to Michelangelo. Leonardo da Vinci. Yeah, Italy has been one of the leaders in innovation for thousands of years. European homes and businesses have made a dramatic shift to heat pumps over the last couple of decades. That's right. In 2021 alone, the number of heat pumps installed in Europe has grown by 35%, oh my which is about 2 million units a year now. Wow. Why is that? Well, simple, reducing carbon footprint. Speaking of, yeah. look at what I have here. Electric? That's, of course. You're gonna let me drive? Yeah. All right, let's go. The trend towards electrification of building is pretty similar to what we're seeing in the car industry, gas engine to electric cars now. The inverter is the secret sauce. That's right, exactly. I gotcha, okay. In a car, you can drive at different or viable speeds, right, depending on the road conditions. So similar to the car, they are designed to only use the amount of energy that you need in real time and to adapt to the exact conditions. I am seeing heat pump systems all over down here, and a lot of them are Daikin. Well, in Europe, energy and space is really at a premium, right? So highly efficient inverter heat pumps are used to heat and cool the whole house. It's just amazing to me how in this ancient city, they've literally embraced Daikin innovative technology to help them thrive into the future. That's right, it's so important for future generations. Heating and cooling is really important. Talking about cooling. To see and learn more, visit sustainabilityseries.com.